hello welcome back uh, it's me Kiza Thomas again so today we are going to go through campus have the basic training of campus so we can all open our softwares and then go to campus open it up so we are going to have the first training in campus so my software has opened and I put in my the password which is landmark one I hope we all know the password for the software to open so you put in the password and wait for the software to open So depending on how fast your computer is, the software will eventually open and then uh, when it has completed opening, it will bring a file like this one. Now we are going to see the basic introduction of Compass software. So with Compass, uh, when we are starting, most times you may not have this. You may have it or may not have it so you got file click on file now on file you can either import work that you already have on your desktop or someone has shared it with you you can export your data if you are done with uh, if you're done with uh, doing your project and share it with someone or you can open a project that you had opened previously that you already have that you had built so today we are going to have our new project so we go to new and then go to instant survey we are going to create our first survey so in this after you click on instant survey we go to the company so you have to give the company name so the company name today we are going to use elite as our company name and the project we can call it a project we can call it project T we have project T and we can also call this site site T but when you're doing your work you can always uh, cite which project you're using and give the right names the appropriate names this is for purposes of practice then we can call this well one and then we have a well ball we can use well ball one and the design we can also give, call it uh, we can call it design one for now design design one so after you fill the names we go to the next part which is the geodetic system now in the geodetic system you can use flat earth or you can use any other depending on the geodetic system of your of your country for Uganda we use the WGS 1984 so you can also select the map zone now when we reach this part you have to put in the northings and the eastings of the location in which your uh, the well that you're going to construct is located then you also choose if it's an offshore system you click on offshore if it is offshore and subsea you click on offshore subsea so with this i think uh we have concluded our first part which is uh our second part which is putting in the names and this is where we stop when you complete you click on okay when you're done feeding all these so we are going to construct a land rig that's why i've clicked on okay so for this session of naming we are stopping here thank you very much uh let's we are going to proceed with the next video